Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. Overview of global energy consumption and the need for conservation. Answer. Overview of global energy consumption and the need for conservation. Introduction to global energy consumption. Energy consumption refers to the amount of energy used by individuals, businesses, and countries. This energy can come from various sources, including fossil fuels like coal, oil, and natural gas, nuclear power, and renewable sources, such as solar, wind, hydroelectric, and geothermal energy. As the world's population grows and economies expand, the demand for energy continues to rise, leading to significant challenges in terms of sustainability and environmental impact. Current state of global energy consumption. One, energy sources. The global energy mix is predominantly made up of fossil fuels, which account for about 80. Example, in 2020, approximately 84 to. Regional variations. Energy consumption varies greatly across different regions due to factors like economic development, population size, and natural resource availability. For instance, developed countries like the United States and those in Europe tend to consume more energy per capita than developing countries. Example, in 2019, the average American consumed over 300 million British thermal units, BTUs, of energy compared to around 70 million BTUs for an average person in Sub-Saharan Africa. 3. Growing Demand As developing nations industrialize and urbanize, their energy needs are expected to increase significantly. Countries like India and China are experiencing unprecedented economic growth, leading to higher energy consumption rates. Example, China's energy consumption has doubled from 2000 to 2020. This rapid increase is largely driven by industrial growth and urbanization, showcasing the link between economic development and energy use. The need for energy conservation. One, environmental impact. The reliance on fossil fuels results in harmful emissions, contributing to climate change and air pollution. Transportation, heating, and electricity generation from fossil sources release carbon dioxide, CO2, and other pollutants into the atmosphere. Example, the burning of fossil fuels is responsible for about 70. 2. Resource depletion. Fossil fuels are finite resources. As reserves dwindle, extraction becomes more challenging and environmentally damaging. This scarcity raises concerns about long-term energy security. Example, the depletion of easily accessible oil reserves has led to deeper offshore drilling and more environmentally harmful extraction methods, increasing the risk of oil spills and habitat destruction. 3. Economic Considerations Efficient energy use translates to lower energy bills for individuals and businesses. Reducing consumption can alleviate pressure on energy prices, which can fluctuate based on global supply and demand dynamics. Example. Implementing energy-efficient appliances and practices in homes and offices can lead to significant cost savings, motivating consumers to adopt conservation measures. Key Concepts in Energy Conservation 1. Energy Efficiency. This refers to using less energy to provide the same service. For instance, energy-efficient LED bulbs use about 75. 2. Renewable Energy. Transitioning to renewable energy sources like solar, Wind and hydro can reduce dependence on fossil fuels and lower environmental impacts. 3. Behavioral change. Small changes in daily habits, such as turning off lights when leaving a room or using public transportation, can significantly reduce overall energy consumption. 4. Technological innovation. Advances in technology can lead to more efficient energy systems and appliances. For instance, smart thermostats optimize heating and cooling in homes reducing unnecessary energy use. Practical Applications of Energy Conservation 1. Home Improvements. Homeowners can reduce energy consumption through insulation, energy-efficient windows, and smart home technology. These improvements not only conserve energy, but can also increase property value. 2. Corporate Initiatives. Businesses can implement sustainability programs focusing on energy consumption reduction through practices such as switching to renewable power sources, encouraging telecommuting, and optimizing logistics. 3. Government Policies Governments can promote energy conservation through incentives 
regulations, and public awareness campaigns. For example, providing tax credits for renewable energy installations encourages more individuals and businesses to invest. For community efforts, local governments and organizations can organize community programs aimed at educating citizens about energy conservation and providing resources to improve energy efficiency at home. Conclusion Understanding global energy consumption and the importance of conservation is crucial for creating a sustainable future. As our energy needs grow, adopting energy-efficient practices, investing in renewable energy, and making informed choices can significantly impact environmental health, economic stability, and resource sustainability. By recognizing the interdependence between energy consumption and conservation, we can all contribute to a more sustainable and resilient planet.